Suns hosting the T-Wolves, and the Suns are four-point favorites. The over-under is at 207. The T-Wolves are plus 148 on the money line, and the Suns are minus 176. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip off tomorrow. The T-Wolves took both games in Minnesota, 120-95, and then 105-93. The lineups for tomorrow's game are supposed to be Conley, Edwards, McDaniels, Townsend, Gobert, Booker, Beal, Allen, Durant, and Nurch. And considering that Towns got himself in foul trouble and pretty much sat the entire fourth quarter of last game, and they still won convincingly, Booker and Durant both haven't scored 20 points in the same game yet in this series. If you're a Suns fan, you've got something seriously to be worried about because there's no offense. Teams are figuring out, stop Booker, stop Durant, stop one of them, and they're not going to beat you, and it's been working. The Suns are 7-3 in their last 10. The T-Wolves are on a two-game winning streak against the Suns. The home team is on a two-game winning streak. The home team is 7-3. And, and let me uh, specify the Suns are 7-3 against the T-Wolves in their last 10. The favorite has won and covered the last two. The favorite is 6-4 and four against the spread. The favorite is 7-3 and three on the money line. The over is 6-4. and four, And the over at 206.5 or at 207. Either way, it's 8-2. and two. I don't like the Suns' chances in this game. They just haven't shown anything. And like I said, with the T-Wolves getting themselves in foul trouble and their players not playing the way that completely the way that they're supposed to, Towns, Towns didn't play very well in the last game. Edwards played like trash for most of the game, and they still won. I'm going to take the T-Wolves with the money line. I'm going to take the T-Wolves getting the points, and I will go over in this one. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.